mind to make sure that they were coded in such a way, even had there been infiltration, then they would have had a, a devil's own job of getting information that they're after. The Blue Steel tests commenced in 1956. Blue Steel was conceived to be carried part way to the target by the V bomber. After being dropped from the bomb bay, the missile was powered by its own solid fuel motor. It would soar to an altitude of 80,000 feet and cross hundreds of kilometers of enemy territory before diving steeply to impact on the target. While some V bombers were trialing blue steel missiles at Woomera, others were at Maralinga, the nuclear bomb test site 300 kilometers to the west, testing the warhead intended for the blue steel. The atomic device was called Blue Danube. the British had successfully tested the warhead. She now had her own nuclear deterrent. But despite years of tests, Blue Steel was never commissioned. between their daily work and the tests at Maralinga. 